students welcome to i exam week in today's video we will study about soil classification some concepts related to it as well as the mcqs now mainly can anyone tell me what is this image this image is of alluvial soil which is one of the soil type that is mainly found in india so according to icr an all india soil survey committee has divided the indian soil into eight major groups these groups are alluvial soil black soil red soil laterite soil arid and desert soil saline and alkaline soil peaty and marshy and forest and mountain so among these eight groups the first five are mainly found in india the rest are found in very minute concentration here and there okay so this alluvial soil as we have seen this is the image and it is mainly formed from the river the sediments that get deposited along the river basin so they form the alluvial soil the black soil which is seen in this image mainly the black color of soil is due to the presence of titaniferous magnetite the red soil has red color due to the presence of iron oxide these are some of the questions which are previously asked in the exam so do remember them now let's study about their distribution it is clear from this image the forest and mountain soil can be seen in the upper hilly areas of jammu and kashmir some regions of sikkim and northeast that is the assam region also the alluvial soil starting from punjab it extends up to assam region in the east from west to east from punjab to assam major areas covered up as well as the bihar region the red and yellow soils are found in these areas that is mainly the chatisgarh chatisgarh orissa and the southern region of karnataka tamil nadu the red soil is dominating the black soil is mainly found in the maharashtra region that is the deccan trap region in madhya pradesh maharashtra and some regions of andhra and karnataka the laterite soil can be seen covering the hills of kerala and some minor regions like that of the west bengal as well as some northeastern states the arid soil is mainly found in the thar desert region of rajasthan and gujarat so let's study about them alluvial soil is mainly formed by the deposition of sediments that are carried by the river river so they are mainly deposited in the river basin and hence they are known as the riverines these soils are dominating and is found in major amount widely distributed that is 45.6% of the total land mass is covered by alluvial soil mainly found in the states of gujarat punjab haryana up bihar and jharkhand and it is the most fertile soil which is rich in potash and lime it is further divided into two the newer one is known as the khadar and the older one is known as bhangar now this khadar soil is less cankery and the bhangar soil is more cankerous due to the presence of bed of lime this lacks in nitrogen and phosphorus and major variety of rabi and kharif crops can be grown in this soil next one also major soil orders that is in septisols and antisols are responsible for their formation next one is the black soil or the rigar soil now this black soil is mainly found in the deccan trap region of maharashtra and it is also known as the black cotton soil because it is suitable for the cultivation of cotton this soil is formed from the lava action of rocks also this crop is formed from the soil order vertisol and it contains mainly mod morillonite clay mineral it is found in the state of deccan plateau maharashtra madhya pradesh gujarat andhra pradesh tamil nadu and some valleys of krishna and kaveri and it is rich in lime iron magnesia aluminia and potash it lacks in phosphorus nitrogen and organic matter and the crops that are suitable for its cultivation are these next one is the red soil red soil is also known as early soil because it is favorable in the cultivation of because it favors the early sowing of crops now the approximately 10.6% of total land mass is made, covered by red soil and is mainly found in the southern region the black soil is approximately 16.6% found in approximately 16.6% of area now this red soil 
is mainly found in the states of eastern and southern part of Deccan Plateau and Chhattisgarh. It is rich in iron and potash. This also has high phosphorus fixation capacity due to the presence of kaolinite clay minerals and the major soil order from which it is formed is alpha soil. It is suitable for growing wheat, rice, cotton, sugarcane and pulses. The laterite soil, next one, important soil which is mainly formed by the action of heavy rainfall and high temperature and the soil order which is responsible for its formation are altisols and oxisols. Also, these are found in some regions of Karnataka, Kerala, Tamil Nadu, Madhya Pradesh, Assam and Oisa hills. They are rich in iron and aluminium oxide and potash. Also, they are somewhat acidic with a pH of 4.5 to 6.5. These are suitable for the cultivation of plantation crops as well as rice. And in this soil, maximum leaching takes place. They lack organic matter, nitrogen, phosphate and calcium. So, maximum leaching takes place in this soil. The arid and desert soil which is found mainly in the Thar Desert region that is the western Rajasthan, northern Gujarat and southern Punjab region is mainly suitable for the cultivation of cactus as well as some drought resistant and salt tolerant crops like barley, rapeseed, musk, cotton, millets, maize and pulses. The saline and alkaline soil are unfit for agriculture so they are not so significant to be studied but just remember that alkaline soils have a pH that is more than 8.5. Next, we will study about some of the questions related to them which have been previously asked in the exam. The first question is, soil formed due to white diffusion of iron oxide is black soil, alluvial soil, red soil, rigor soil or laterite soil. The correct answer among this will be red soil. Next is, what is the major soil in North Indian plains? Mountainous soil, black soil, red soil, alluvial soil or rigor soil. So, the major soil in the North Indian plain is alluvial soil which covers about 45.6% of the total landmark. The red color of the red soil is due to the presence of iron oxide and this soil is also known as early soil and it has a concentration of about 10.6% of the total landmarks. Next one is the which soil type has highest phosphorus fixing capacity. We have studied recently the correct answer will be option number D that is red soil due to the presence of kaolinite clay mineral. Next is, which soil is highly rich in potash and lime? Options are laterite, alluvial, black, red or peaty. It is highly rich in potash and lime, so that is alluvial soil. Which of the following pair is correctly matched? These are the options and among them, the correct answer will be only B. Alkali soil has a pH of 9. Red soil is not calcareous. Black soil is not rich in kaolinite. It is rich in mottmolinite. Lateral soil has a pH range of about 4.5 to 6.5 which is somewhat acidic. And this red soil, it mainly consists of iron oxide. Alkaline soil are usually calcareous in nature. So the correct option among these will be option number B. You can also join our course. We are offering 50% off and you can use this or grab the opportunity by using the code NAP50. Thanks for watching. Do like and subscribe our channel if you like the content of the video and don't forget to like the video.